Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Today I will show you GPT-4 visual input, how it's working and when it's going to be available. So as you know, uh, GPT-4 actually rolled out a visual input, right? This is basically how, uh, you know, a visual input will look like and how it will basically uh, be, you know, available when it's going to be available, right? So this is basically what you will be able to do. It can accept images as inputs and generate captions, right? So as you can see, this is basically what you will be able to do with an image, right? You will be able to input the image and then you will be able to get the description of an image in the output, right? So a lot of people are wondering when is this going to be available? So I actually stumbled upon this Reddit article right here and it says GPT-4 on Plus account does not take visual input or longer context like OpenAI advertised it would. Now, as you can see, here are some of the discussion. As you can see, you were not promised anything of the sort. What was announced today was the GPT-4 API. That is where the increased token limits are. Nowhere did they say the GPT-4 product would have those features right away. So actually these features are not yet available and no one knows when they will be available because OpenAI actually said that they will be rolling these features out later down the line. As you can see, they literally said multiple times that the image portion of the feature would not be rolled out right away, obviously, right? Now, as you can see, GPT-4 is a base technology with, which has different input models and ChatGPT is an application which implements only its text input capabilities. OpenAI states that in the current public implementation support text input only, right? Now, they will be releasing an image input uh, very, very soon. I bet they are partnering with uh, another company that is called right here, if I may, uh, you know, find it correct, a single partner right here. Be My Eyes is a company that they're partnering with in order to basically get that image input in GPT-4. So right now, GPT-4 visual input is only available for a select few of people, as uh, OpenAI stated. But until then, you know, we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.